Hello viewers, how are you doing? Welcome to my channel. You are watching Wargaming TV. My name is Darvej Kaur and we are playing Call of Cthulhu. I want to say that thank you guys. Uh, whoever of you have watched the whole series. And this is going to be I guess the ending of Call of Cthulhu. I am going to end this game in this part. So if you are new to my channel please like and subscribe and join my discord server link in the description also comment down below after watching the video what you felt about this and let's go guys this is going to be the ending i'm going to end this i'm going to play this as long as this ends okay let's go so you ignore the boat and you go here Alabaster point after a final confrontation Pierce must go to Alabaster point where Sarah Hawkins is supposed to be waiting for him There he must make decisions that could change the destiny of the world Okay, let's go Very interesting game though. Reality as you know it stops here. None of this makes sense. Go. She is waiting. The way that Leviathan is putting all his efforts onto Edward Pierce means I think Edward Pierce is the one that can also end this Ah, Mr. Pierce. I was expecting you. Fuller. You died in front of my eyes. Don't jump to conclusions. Is there not the tiniest spark of a scientific mind inside of that detective skull of yours? What abject substance did you use to turn her into an empty shell? Abject substance. The serum extracted from Leviathan's oil bestows the power of life. To me, my body is nothing but the mortal vessel of my conscience. To you, it contains more answers and secrets than your insignificant mind can grasp. Okay, this is going to be the ending. Very close. You can see the towers and stuff. That is not you. Not anymore. Not since your disappearance on the docks. Ah, uh, detective. So easy to fool you. So eager to rush to the rescue of a woman in distress. You won't make me regret having tried to save people. I did what I could. Even for Colden. Your efforts to change your destiny, although in vain, make you worthy of the fate that is yours. The day has come. You will be asked to choose. garbage Charles Hawkins you 
took everything from me. Wife. Life. Destiny. You forsook your right to a normal life. The moment you chose power over humanity. No one wants to see such an unbearable sight. You don't have the slightest idea of what you speak, of what I've been through. I have sacrificed my life to the one who sleeps. My marriage, my family, my own flesh. Why didn't Sarah choose me? Why is it your damn face on her painting? Look at that body though. But you already know it. I can see that you will make the right choice. I don't know. I don't know. So, you decided to shut your eyes. Find refuge in denial like a spooked child. You've lost your mind. And to think mankind's future is on your shoulders. So the Leviathan is trying everything is to real. bring himself into the guts. world. If nothing's real, what are you? I am a projection of your mind. What remains of that instinct that pulled you out of the trenches? You rejected her half truths. Hell yeah. Reject half truths. I love this game, very fantasy like. I think if they didn't put the horror part, that would be awesome. It's right there. I'm almost there. Game save. Here you are at last, truth seeker. She was waiting for you. You were waiting for me. Yes. When I finally discovered the truth, I knew you would come. All this time I was fighting it, afraid of what I might discover. But I was afraid of myself. It's coming. What did you learn? <laughs> Listen to me, Edward Pierce, as I will deliver the truth. Look around you. Everything is falling apart. You must stop this madness. I can't make that choice. This will be your decision. One man, one man only prepared by the trials and revelations, holds the power to change the world. That is because bullshit. Because I saw you in the dreams I share with my God. I recognize you for what you are. A truth seeker. One of the rare humans who is able to perceive fragments of his mind. Yes, yes. I feel the truth in your words. Because it was written, or as I like to see it, painted on the canvas of fate. Pierce, help me!
He still has the gun. Oh, here's the thing. Here's the thing when we choose what's going to happen. man what do you think I should choose comment down below come on whenever you're watching this comment down below So there are four endings to this. there's four endings to this one is the default ending where we do the ritual which is this one second one is the counter ritual okay spoiler alert in the first ending Basically you do the ritual and complete the game kind of stuff. Okay. In the second ending. Spoiler alerts. Okay. In the second ending. Don't hear this if you don't want to lose the suspense. Maybe you can skip to a more like further part. Okay wait. I will not tell you the I will not tell you the consequences right now I will tell you in the end I will tell you what you require for this okay let me stop this stupid music for some time so first ending you first ending is that default ending it like you get it by default whatever choices you make in the game second ending is the counter ritual to get this you have to never drink alcohol uh, read all the books Sanders wife should know the truth answer nine times in Raleighian language and accept Drake's help offer and rescue him during the final battle with the shambler also kill Bradley chapter 12 accept the Leviathan's knowledge in chapter 13 refuse to eat Leviathan's flesh don't take a weapon also drink the medicine your first aid kit to the cat and examine Michelle's corpse okay this is the second ending third ending is it's over which you see in the dialogue I did not get the option for fourth ending so I'll tell you third ending to get the third third ending drink alcohol read all the books don't answer in Rileyan language accept Drake's offer and save him during the Shambler fight rescue Bradley don't accept Leviathan's knowledge refuse to eat Leviathan's flesh don't take a weapon also don't drink the medicine that's what we did that's why we got the uh, it's over ending 
okay and where's the fourth one oh sorry third ending is sacrifice oneself in this article which I am reading but I guess it's like fourth ending for us in okay okay so sorry I'll read this again for you default ending is the default ending it gives you by default uh, second one is counter ritual uh, here the only condition is that Drake has to survive the final battle with the Shambler and you have to do the counter ritual third one is sacrifice oneself never drink alcohol read all the books Sanders wife should know the truth answer nine times in Rilehian language accept Drake's offer and he should Drake should survive Shambler's fight kill Bradley accept Leviathan knowledge Refuse eat Leviathan's flesh, give first aid kit to cat and examine Michelle. Also, don't take a weapon, don't drink medicine. That's the sacrifice oneself ending. And the fourth ending, which is third ending for us, is its over ending. Where you drink alcohol, read all the books, don't, don't answer in Rileyan language, accept Drake's help, Drake the scholar, and save him in the Shambler's battle. Rescue Bradley, which we did. Bradley is the police officer, if you don't remember. Don't accept Leviathan's knowledge, which we did in the prison. In chapter 13, don't eat Leviathan's flesh, which we did not eat. Don't take a weapon, we did not take a weapon. Also, don't drink medicine, which we did not drink the medicine. So, we avoided his manipulations. Now, this one, I am going to do its over ending. Comment down below, guys what do you think is going to happen and also comment down below what choices you got and what endings you chose or what endings you would like to choose also you can tell me what do you feel about this game or how after you watch the endings were they justified and this and that I am going to choose its over ending because that's the logical part can't let you do this. Who is Simon though? Oh, Simon, okay. That is it. Dedicated to the founder of the Chaos GM. You read that, you can pause and read. Okay, so basically she killed herself. 
she thought that doing the ritual would save bring back her son i think that would have brought back something else so this was the it's over ending and the ritual is broken world is safe now guys poof so much for so little i think there would be like a cinematic big ending stuff but this was very quick lol awesome game really awesome game loved this although i loved the detective part and not the horror stuff stupid horror stuff which was all i guess kind of inverted commas imagination of edward pierce and sarah hawkins and what not so yeah i guess many of you call of cthulhu fans will watch this comment down below what you felt about this series i personally enjoyed this game and i would like to play more detective games and present to you more awesome videos please subscribe to my channel guys also before i go i want to tell you consequences of all the endings Okay. Thank God. There's still some cinematics. That's Sarah Hawkins. All right, game over. Let me mute this quickly. Okay. So let me tell you the consequences of other three endings. So basically when you perform the ritual you get to see the leviathan. Oh, so sorry. Get to see the leviathan. sacrifice oneself okay no so sorry when you do the counter ritual the main character will end in a mental hospital so this guy goes crazy and ends up in the mental hospital cuz he is not able to understand what happened how he stopped everything and all that stuff in the sacrifice oneself ending main character will sacrifice himself basically he will kill himself and it's over ending you saw what happened sarah will kill himself uh, herself sorry i'll show you i'll show you when you do the count ritual stuff and i'll also show you when you do the ritual
I want to see the huge leviathan which they always show us in the main menu of the game. Here you are. You were waiting. Let us yeah, skip the, the dialogues. <laughs> Listen. Look around. Everything. My I can't one because I truths. I feel that. Because. Pierce, help me. Let's do the counter ritual. You. Dosage, as you asked us to, Doctor. Good, thank you. Oh, he ends up in Dr. Fuller's asylum. Shit. Oh. <laughs> and we got the fight destiny achievement. This is when we do the counter of this thing. Now let us see when we do the ritual what what happens then. Also in sacrifice oneself basically you kill yourself so even if it's not there in my choices for the endings that's all that happens instead of Sarah dying this guy dies like in the painting he violently gets ripped apart I guess something like that let's see if what happens if we accept the ritual let's go I wanna see that leviathan guy octopus head sack of shit Here you are at last. You were yeah, all that I wanted. Listen. Look around. Everything. I want to get true. I feel because. Pierce, help me! Who is this guy now? Okay. Fitzroy
kind of pace though, man. So There comes the Leviathan. What is that? Oh, Greg Stafford, okay. You That's it. Who is this? Is she Sarah Hawkins or what? God damn it. Call of Cthulhu. I like the it's over ending. I guess the video has ended guys. I'm just gonna watch this again just for some entertainment. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. Join my discord, comment down below any other games you want to see me play. Next game I'm gonna start is Sherlock Holmes. So stay tuned for that. Also check out my CSGO montages. I am going to release like one montage every week now. So thank you for watching. Watching. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. See you later. Bye bye.
Here you are at last, truth seeker. You were waiting for who? You were waiting for me. Yes. When I finally discovered the truth, I knew you would come. All this time I was fighting it, afraid of what I might discover, but I was afraid of myself. It's coming. What did you learn? <laughs> Listen to me, Edward Pierce, as I will deliver the truth. Look around you. Everything is falling apart. You must stop this madness. I can't make that choice. This will be your decision. One man, one man only, prepared by the trials and revelations, holds the power to change the world. Because I saw you in the dreams I share with my God. I recognize you for what you are, a truth seeker. One of the rare humans who is able to perceive fragments of his mind. Yes, yes! I feel the truth in your words. Because it was written, or, as I like to see it, painted on the canvas of fate. Pierce, help me! can't let 